Binomial theorem. Before we start binomial theorem, we need to know what is binomial. Binomial means all those terms which are written like this a plus x, x minus 1, 3 minus y, or a plus b, or a minus b. Whenever there is a relation or operation between two terms, will be called binomial expression or uh, these are the expressions actually binomial expressions so now let us see how the binomial theorem will be so let's say we have a plus b whole raised to power n so a raised to power n plus now n divided by 1 a raised to power n minus 1 and b raised to power 1 now if you add both the powers n minus 1 plus 1 plus 1 minus 1 cancel it gives you n then plus n into n minus 1 be between them will be multiplication upside it will decrease and downside it will increase 1 times 2 then a raised to power n minus 1 now n minus 2 and b raised to power 2 plus n times n minus 1 n minus 2 divided by 1 times 2 times 3 a raised to power n minus 3 and b raised to power 3 so it will continue like that then at the end b will have power n in the beginning a was having power n the first alphabet first term now the second term will have at the end b raised to power n so this is our binomial theorem let us see how we are opening our formulas like uh, if we have uh, a plus b whole raised to power let's say 5 so a raised to power 5 plus 5 divided by 1 a raised to power 5 minus 1 4 and then b plus 5 times 4 divided by 1 times 2 a raised to power 3 4 minus 1 will be 3 so b raised to power 2 if you do the sum here on the powers it will give you power equal to the main power 3 plus 2 will be 5 plus 5 times 4 times 3 divided by 1 times 2 times 3 a raised to power 2 and then b will have power 3 it will continue like this 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 and then divided by 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 a raised to power 1 and then b raised to power 4 now we have raised b raised to power 4 at the end when we are going to write 5 4 3 2 1 downside 1 2 3 4 5 they will cancel each other what we left behind is b raised to power 5 only so this is our formula if you simplify it that will be your formula like uh, so a raised to power 5 plus 5 a raised to power 4 b plus 2 into itself 1 2 into 4 2 times 10 a raised to power 3 b raised to power 2 plus 3 cancel with 3 here 2 5 times 2 10 a square b raised to power 3 plus 2 3 4 cancel with 2 3 4 5 a b raised to power 4 plus b raised to power 5 so this is your formula when we have a minus b a minus b whole raised to power n how are we going to have our formula here so I will convert it like this a plus minus b whole raised to power n to make it easier now it is just like the way we have it a plus minus b whole raised to power n now it will be same the way it was a raised to power n plus n divided by 1 a raised to power n minus 1 and minus b raised to power 1 plus n into n minus 1 divided by 1 times 2 and then a raised to power n minus 
2 and then minus b whole raised to power 2 plus n into n minus 1 n minus 2 divided by 1 times 2 times 3 a raised to power n minus 2 now n minus 3 minus b raised to power 3 so it will continue like that plus till the end plus minus b whole raised to power n now let us see how are we going to have a minus b whole raised to power 5 a minus b whole raised to power 5 so in this way we will make it like this a plus minus b whole raised to power 5 now a raised to power 5 whenever the power is odd this minus will come outside whenever power is even this power uh, minus will be absorbed now sorry minus 5 a raised to power 4 b this one cancel with this 5 times 2 10 a raised to power 3 and b square now again this is odd power will come sorry this minus will come outside minus times plus minus so this one cancel here 10 a square b raised to power 3 again power here is or even number so power will is here sorry minus will be absorbed plus 2 3 cancel with 2 3 then 4 cancel with 4 5 a b raised to power 4 then power is odd this minus will come out minus times plus minus b raised to power 5 so this is the formula when it is in minus it want you to work on this a plus b raised to power 10 and a minus b raised to power 10 i want you to solve these for me and give me the answer in comments thank you